One of the most common things we get asked um, about block walls is, and a lot of clients I request block walls because they say they're stronger, um, which is a common perception, but in actual fact it's not. Your internal block walls are a combination of width of 90 mil, which is basically a little skinny block wall, or as I said before, your, your uh, bracing walls, which are a thick one. But all your internal walls are basically, they're just as divisional. There's no reinforcing, there's no concrete, there's no structure to it at all. Um, so they're not strong, um, strong at all. They're not tied in like these. You can see here, that's really tied in. It's tied into the roof, it's tied in the walls. These things are strong. Now, if we had a block wall there at this same stage and we did the same thing, it would actually fall over. So that common perception that they're stronger uh, is not true. Another one is you, with your render. If you happen to damage a corner or damage a block wall uh, and render it all, you can't patch it. Or if you can patch it, you always see that patch there uh, where our frame walls and plasterboard, you can knock a hole in it, you can then patch it up, sand it, repaint it and you never know there's even been a, been a patch there. So that's one of the other advantages with it. But um, yeah, the perception they're stronger, definitely not stronger at all. Our timber frames um, have had the strength in them uh, a lot more than block.